Today I'll be showing you a step-by-step -step process for creating a syllabus quiz in Blackboard 9.1 using the adaptive release. For this syllabus quiz, the students must pass the test with a 100% in order to access any of their course content, excluding features like email and the Start Here information. The syllabus quiz provides an accountability for students reading all of the starting information contained in your Start Here folder. It encourages an understanding of the course before they are able to access any of the content. It also limits later confusion and allows the students to have a better understanding of the course procedures and of important institution information. To get started on your syllabus quiz, it is only fair to inform your students that they have a quiz which they must pass with a 100% in order to access any of their course content. I have posted an announcement here. To begin this course, please click the Start Here section of the course, read all information contained in the subfolders, then you must complete the syllabus quiz with a 100% in order to access any of the course content. To begin to create your syllabus quiz, move over to the left-hand side of the screen and click the Start Here link. As you can see, the Start Here is currently empty for this sample. Should this have been a real course, it would have contained a welcome letter, institution policies, course procedures, a syllabus, and other information dictating what sort of file formats are accepted and other important course procedures. To create your syllabus quiz, move over to Assessments, and select Test. You can either create your own new test or you can upload an already existing syllabus quiz. I'm going to select the syllabus quiz from my online philosophy course. Click Submit. To configure this test, please move down to Test Availability, make the link available, and add an announcement for this test. Also under test availability, select multiple attempts. Since they must pass this with a 100%, it is not fair to allow them only one go at it. Allow unlimited attempts so they may take it as many times as necessary to complete a 100%. Scoring attempts. Instead of using the last graded attempt, use the highest grade. I do not use a display after or a display until, nor do I use a due date. I would like the syllabus quiz to be available throughout the duration of the course. Though this is a no credit quiz for my class, I leave this checked. Include this test in grade center score calculations. If you do not have this checked, Blackboard 9.1 will not be able to see what their progress is on the quiz, nor will it be able to use the adaptive release to show them their course information once they've completed the quiz. Scroll down and click Submit on the bottom right hand side. Now move over to the left hand side of your screen under Grade Center and select Full Grade Center. Scroll over to the right and you will see the syllabus quiz already there. However, what we want to configure is the total column. Click the chevron on the right hand side of the total column. Click Edit Column Information. In my class, the syllabus quiz is a no credit quiz. They do not get credit for the basic prerequisite understanding of the syllabus and course procedures. It is a prerequisite for understanding and accessing course content. So, in under 3, select Columns. Under, under Include in Total, select Selected Columns and Categories. I'm placing other assignments other than the syllabus quiz into my total column. I am excluding the syllabus quiz for online philosophy and selecting Submit. Now, all of the assignments in this sample course are included in the total column. The syllabus quiz is excluded.
they may see their progress under the grade center, and you may see their progress under the grade center, though it does not count for their total score in the class. Now, move over to the left-hand side of your screen and select Course Content. For my course content, I have it all in subfolders under a larger folder, Introduction, Introduction to Philosophy Course Content. Here they will be able to see what to do on week one, week two, and week three, and so on. You can configure all of these individually under the adaptive release. However, it is easier to place them all into a larger folder and configure the adaptive release for that. So, on the Introduction to Philosophy course content, I'm clicking the chevron and setting Adaptive Release. Under the Adaptive Release, you want under number 3 to select a Grade Center column. The Grade Center column that they must complete is the Syllabus Quiz. One thing to take note of is see that there is a number beside the Test Syllabus Quiz Online Philosophy. This indicates that there is a point value for this quiz. There must be a point value for this quiz. You cannot set the point value to zero to make it no credit. Otherwise, Blackboard will have no means of tracking their progress for this quiz. For their score, it must be greater than or equal to 12. The adaptive release will only release the course content to those students that have received a 12 or greater on the syllabus quiz. Click Submit. I thought it was only fair to give my students an additional warning and additional notice, and also to prevent confused emails from arriving in my inbox, wondering why the course content is not available. I have created an additional page that says, please take slash retake the syllabus quiz. In order to view your course content, you must complete the syllabus quiz with a 100%. Click the Start Here link on the left-hand side of your screen then proceed to either take or retake the syllabus quiz. You may take it as many times as necessary to receive a 100%. Click the chevron on the right-hand side of that page. Select Adaptive Release. This page will only be visible to those who meet certain conditions. So, under Select a Grade Center column, select Syllabus Quiz Online Philosophy. Now, for this, we want their score to be less than or equal to 11. Anyone who has an 11 or below on the syllabus quiz will be able to see this announcement. Once they've achieved a score greater than 11, this announcement will disappear. Click Submit. Now you have properly configured your syllabus quiz and set your adaptive release so that your students must complete a basic requisite standard of understanding of the course in order to proceed to their course content and begin their work. Let's review. Inform the students that they have a quiz that they must pass with a 100% in order to access any of their course content. Create the quiz. Configure your grade center so that they do not earn any points for the quiz then set the adaptive release.